Hello and welcome to Marriott MBA Today. I'm your host, Josh Gelton, and joining us is Jill Newell, President of Women in Management. Jill, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. No problem. Jill, uh, so I, I understand that you've recently been selected as President of Women in Management. But before we get into Women in Management, would you mind telling us a little bit about yourself and your background? Sure, I'd be happy to. So um, I've been working for 10 years professionally, five years as a teacher in Compton, and then five years in Washington, D.C. for a nonprofit. Um, I actually never thought that I would get an MBA. Um, I remember as a 20-year-old undergrad walking through the Tanner Building and having thoughts in my head such as, I'll never have to take a class here because I'm not smart <laughs> enough. So <laughs> it's pretty fantastic to, to be in a place that I've always respected so much and, um, and to be getting my MBA. Great. Yeah. That sounds like a good story. So how did you end up in Women in Management and in the presidency? How, what was that process like? So from the very first experience that I had with women in management, which was during the orientation, um, the orientation week that we had as first years, um, I went to the breakfast and I knew right away that I would be involved with the club and um, I knew that I would be connected with these women for the rest of my life. And so when an opportunity came up to become the president of women in management, um, I was more than happy to do it and I have a fantastic team um, who is just going to put together a stellar year for us next year. Great. Yeah. So for those who aren't familiar with women in management, can you give us a little background on what the mission and purpose of women in management is? Certainly. The purpose of women in management is to provide uh, professional development, networking opportunities, and support to women who are in the MBA, and also women who are in graduate programs within the Marriott School, um, any program within the Marriott School that's graduate. And then um, also, our mission is to make certain that we're supporting women so that as they go out after um, receiving their degree, that they have the knowledge and the skills and the support network that they need in order to be successful in the endeavors um, in which, which they pursue. We also want women to feel supported and to, to be developing what they need while they're here in school. And so we think Women in Management is a wonderful club for them to join in order to do that. That sounds like a wonderful club. Yeah. In fact, I'm a little jealous. Can I join? You know, it's a joke, but it's actually true. Men can join women in management to support. Um, we like to call them WIM men. And um, <laughs> what can I say? So we're going to be working this next year to encourage men to join the organization um, so that they might provide their unique perspective. Because quite honestly, um, women in business, we need to have allies to help us to have um, the experiences that we need in order to progress where we'd like to progress within the business world. And so I think women and men joining together um, to work on that will, will provide a better outcome than just women working towards it. I think it's a great opportunity for men to get involved in that. Um, what are your selling points to get in, encourage more men to join when men? <laughs> so our three selling points for men is for them to consider um, do they want to be more effective in their um, in their workspace because definitely they're going to be working with women and they're going to be experiencing women who have a, a very unique perspective just like men have unique perspective. Um, the next is does a man want to be a, a better spouse or a better husband or excuse me boyfriend? Um, I think that 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 will be really helpful as well because once again he's learning more about the women woman's perspective as he attends women events um, and then lastly it's just the right thing to do um, we need to be helping each other out um, within the Marriott school to be successful as we go out into the business world and even while we're in um, in school and so those are the three selling points that I would offer to any man who's considering to join WIM. Great selling points yeah um, what's been one of your favorite memories or favorite times in women, women in management? <laughs> well, I have a lot of wonderful memories of being a woman, but I won't go into that. I'll just, <laughs> I'll just go into um, to women in management. I would have to say that this closing social this past week was fantastic, um, as we had a panel of, um, of three stellar professionals who were able to share with us their experiences. And um, as I looked around the room, I, I honestly can't tell you what those three specialists shared with us because they were fantastic, but it was looking around the room and knowing that I had developed relationships um, with the women who had, uh, were surrounding me. And I knew that we were all shooting for the common goal of, um, of excelling here on this earth because that's what our Heavenly Father has put us here to do is to excel. And I'm completely certain that every single one of those women in that room is certain that this is the path that our Heavenly Father has for her. And it's a little unique, but it's absolutely fantastic. And I know that, that, um, that I, I know and I'm 
I should say, I'm excited to be able to work with women, these women for the rest of my life in that. Oh, thank you for sharing that. Yeah. So as a president, as you look forward to the next year, what are some of the words you would use to describe what you have in store, what women in management is going to be like next year? <laughs> You're doing a really good job with that name, so I'd like I to... I want to say whim, but... <laughs> You're getting better and better. I hope you'll, you'll become an honorary member next year. I would be honored. Uh, thank you. Um, I would say three words to describe women in management for the 2015-2016 year. They would be um, relevance, they would be usefulness, and empowerment. We really, really want to help women to, f to feel all three of those words and experience all three of those words as they come to women in management events and activities. Yep. Great. Jill, thank you for joining us today on Mary MBA Today, and thank you for enlightening us on women in management. <laughs> Fantastic. Thank you so much. It was great to come. And thank you for joining us on another episode of Mary MBA Today.